Well, joining me this morning is Andrea Deckard, a consumer blogger who does, uh, you know, the shopping and kind of passes on the deals to you. And we're the ones that benefit from all of your work, and that's good. And today we're talking about saving money while you shop, and we all know we do enough of that. So what uh, tips can you offer us? Andrew? Well, I just wanted to share five tips today. Okay. And obviously to save, save while you shop, um, the biggest thing is coupons. Mm -hmm. You know, find the coupons. There's actually coupons in the Sunday inserts. Yeah. Um, and then you can also get printable coupons online. And when you visit Mommy Snacks, my site, um, I help guide you to the places that have the best coupons as well. All right, so you do your shopping for sure here online and blogging, and you let us know about that. So what, what's some of the tips that you can give us, those five tips? Okay, so the, the second thing are the loss leaders. Mm -hmm. And each week, um, you, you obviously are going to shop for the, for the items that are on sale mm -hmm. and the best price. Each week, the, um, the store has, a, uh, has what they call loss leaders. And they're on the front of the, the ad of the week. And okay. what that is is basically items that the store is willing to take a loss on in order to get you in the store to buy those other things that aren't on sale. So that's another thing to look at. And the biggest thing, I think, in all of this is planning. So you need to have a plan for what you're going to shop for, plan your menus, plan your shopping trip, plan your day. That way you can be efficient in the store and you're not going off and purchasing those items that aren't on sale and that hurt your budget. All right. Is it really worth it to, to trim all these coupons, to go through the circulars and all that? It really is. The first year I was really focused on saving money. Like this way I tracked everything in an Excel spreadsheet and I saved $6,500. So, right. um, you know, that's a car for some people and that actually helped pay for our son's surgery expenses. Oh. So, um, it's worth it to me. It's definitely worth it. If we need more information, more savings, where can we go? We can visit, you visit mommysnacks.net. It's my site. All right, very good. Andrew okay. Decker, always great information to save $6,500. Think of that. Huh? Yes. I've got college education to think of, there you so go. I'm going to be clipping some more coupons. Andrew, thanks for coming in today. <laughs>